Hello YouTube, this is Dazza the Cameraman. Today is Wednesday the 15th of April 2015. And uh, today we're talking about the Streisand Effect. If you haven't heard of the Streisand Effect, uh, the Streisand Effect is a phenomenon whereby an attempt to hide, remove or censor a piece of information has the unintended consequence of publicising the information more widely, usually facilitated by the internet. It is named after American entertainer Barbara Streisand, whose 2003 attempt to suppress photographs of her residence in Malibu, California, inadvertently drew further public attention to it. Similar attempts have been made, for example, in cease and desist letters to suppress numbers, files and websites. Instead of being suppressed, the information receives extensive publicity and media extensions such as videos and spoof songs, often been widely mirrored across the internet or distributed on file sharing networks. The origin of the term Mike Masnick of uh, Tech Dirt coined the term after Streisand unsuccessfully sued photographer Kenneth Edelman and Pictopia.com for viola violation of privacy. The US $50, $50 million lawsuit endeavoured to remove an aerial photograph of Streisand's mansion from the publicly available collection of 12,000 California coastline photographs. Edelman photographed the beachfront property to document coastal erosion as part of the California Coastal Records Project, which was intended to influence government policy makers. Before Streisand filed her lawsuit, image 3850 had been downloaded from Edelman's website only six times. Two of those downloads were by Streisand's attorneys. As a result of the case, public knowledge of the picture increased substantially, more than 420,000 people visited the site over the following month. Velcro 777, you're about to find out about the Streisand effect. Uh, you have allowed your agent, your YouTube agent, uh, to file false copyright claims against my videos which were fair use and completely acceptable uh, under copyright law for the purposes of review, commentary and criticism. And as you are aware I have filed uh, counter claims against those two copyright strikes and my experience from past copyright strikes is that they will both be overturned, the videos will be restored to my channel in approximately one month and my channel will be without penalty. If you don't believe me go and ask Dark Skywatcher 74, go and ask um, Denise Chavez, go and ask Marshall Masters to name a few. They all filed copyright claims against me and their claims were unsuccessful. So here is the breaking news. If you're looking for the videos that Crow has censored with false copyright claims, they have been mirrored on channels and they are being uploaded to other channels as we speak. Uh, they have already been uploaded to Django2468's channel and you'll find links in the description area. The two videos have been uploaded to Dutch Dude's channel and you will find links in the description area. And the two videos have been uploaded to ATCF Drummer's YouTube channel and you will find links in the description area. So if you're looking for the now censored videos, Crow 777 Debunkery Project, Lunar Waves and Aircraft Part 1 and Part 2, um, they are now available on these channels and will be uploaded to other channels because that is the Streisand effect in action. Stay tuned for more developments in the Crow 777 saga as we battle to prevent censorship of information and suppression of truth. Fighting against disinformation and misinformation as always, this is Dazza the Cameraman and uh, do check out my Facebook discussion page Voices of Reason to Explain X or Vortex You'll find a link in the description area. And thank you very much to Django2468 
to Dutch D Dude and to ATCF Drummer and to everyone else who has offered to upload my videos. And by the way, if you would like to um, get these videos to upload, you're more than welcome to upload them, share them around, and you can even monetize them if you wish. There we go, that's my little present to you from Dazza the Cameraman. Thank you for watching and stay tuned.